So I had to redo my NFC AFC championship game video. Um, it has every, everything to do with the video that I made about, you know, the, the, uh, they're not going to have the same color scheme in the Super Bowl for three straight years because now it'd be too obvious in Las Vegas. It's just not going to have that happen when they're hosting the Super Bowl. Uh, uh, it, it all happened by design, you see, just so they can get you to bet on the, the, the color scheme happening for three straight years. But, but it's all by design for Las Vegas to make a killing off of the public uh, before they celebrate hosting the Super Bowl. So you got to understand, the Super Bowl is at Las Vegas. The sports books are hosting it, so it's bound to be a postseason of record-breaking profits uh, for the uh, bookies above. Now, uh, so this means that it, uh, the Dolphins will not make it to the AFC Championship game, that the Ravens and the Niners will make it to the NFC Championship game, uh, beginning with the Cowboys defeating the 49ers. It'd be interesting where they play the game at. I mean, there's still a chance the Cowboys can host uh, the NFC Championship game, be a first-round buy, but more likely than not, they'll have to go on the road like the Texas Rangers. Uh, Mike McCarthy and his record in the conference championship game. He was 0-1 there, losing to the Giants, 1-1, 1-2, and 1-3. And 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 so Mike McCarthy is going to be 2-3 and three in the NFC Championship game to make it to the Super Bowl at Las Vegas. And that ultimately is what's going to happen. To improve the 2-3 and three in the NFC Championship game for Mike McCarthy. For Kyle Shanahan, uh, he is going to fall to... One and three in the NFC Championship game, uh, Jim Harbaugh esque. Except he loses another NFC Championship game. Jim Harbaugh lost two NFC Championship games and lost the Super Bowl. Uh, he will fall to one and three in the NFC Championship game. It's Dallas. That's Camacho thirteen. The Cowboys will be the first team to win the Super Bowl since over at Los Angeles. Uh, Los Angeles, the first NFC winner. It's L.A. That's uh, Camatria 13. Um, for Kyle Shanahan, if he if he does get the first round by, then it's pretty easy. 7-4 in the playoffs because the Cowboys in their last victory over the Niners, eliminating the Niners from the postseason in 2020, there was a total of 74 points in that game. Now, if the Niners don't get the first round by, then it's pretty easy. 7-3, 8-3, then 8-4 because of the fact that it's Purdy that's Gamatri of 84 and the Rams is also 84. Now, this has to do with the next NFC winner. doesn't mean it's going to be Purdy. The next NFC team to win the Super Bowl in the NFC side since the Rams can easily defeat Brock Purdy along the way to make it to the Super Bowl. The Cowboys' last Super Bowl appearance occurring in 96. They're improved to 9-6 in the NFC Championship game to make it to Las Vegas where, remember, the Steelers, they won the opening game at Vegas against the Raiders. Uh, it was Kenny Pickett that improved his record to 9-6 and six as a starter when he won that opening game at Vegas. So, so definitely, this is going to be a big connection for the Cowboys uh, to make it to Las Vegas. And, you know, the third time's a charm. That's the script. One win in three games. They're not going to lose to the Niners for three straight years. This is what rivalry's about. They eliminate the Niners from the playoffs. The Niners beat them twice. Now the Cowboys are getting another crack at them. They're going to beat them. In that wild card game, don't forget the Niners scored 23 points. Las Vegas, Gamachi 23. That's, that's when the Cowboys are going to beat them. Now... NFC Wild Card Divisional, it's going to be the Conference Championship game. He'll make it to the Super Bowl on the 42nd day to have a 4 and 2 playoff record with the Cowboys because don't forget that Dak Prescott is going to match you 42. It is his year. The narrative is said, oh, he can't go to the top, top, they can't beat the Niners! They can't beat the Niners! And if the Cowboys win out, they have 23 regular season losses during Mike McCarthy's time as coach. If they lose one and, and win three, then they have 13 wins. Don't be surprised if the Cowboys be 13-3, and three, honestly. 
But as far as wins goes, the Cowboys and Mike McCarthy can finish with 44 regular season wins, or he's stuck at 43 if he loses to either the Bills or the Dolphins. Because they're not losing to the crap Lions on the, on the night that they're honoring Jimmy Johnson and all that 43 days before the Super Bowl reign. Dakota's 43, Dallas Cowboys, Las Vegas, Nevada, Camacho 43. So uh, there we have it. And obviously, Buck Purdy is a 2 and 1. Uh, and if he doesn't get the first round by, he'd fall to four and two easily. Then he'd fall to three and two uh, if he wins the divisional round, because obviously he's only going to win three out of five playoff games. Prescott is going to be the thirty-fifth quarterback to win the Super Bowl. He's the number one quarterback in passing yards. He's the number one on the third down categories. He, I pretty much knew he was. I was the only guy out there who said he's going to be the best quarterback out there this year. Everyone laughed. Look who was on to something, on the right track. Now, okay, the AFC Championship game, let's get the PSYOP going. The Ravens make it to the uh, AFC Championship game. Because obviously, oh, I'm the power level. Oh, I'm going to make it the power level. And the coach gave the power level. It won't happen again. It won't happen again. Go. Go. Oh, my sense it came calling. It's going to be by design. The Baltimore Ravens, they make it to the AFC Championship game. Well, first of all, I want to go to uh, Andy Reid. Well, let, let's get to Andy Reid uh, in a second. The Chiefs obviously can prove the 4-3 and three in the AFC Championship game. Remember, Las Vegas, Nevada is Camacho 43. That's what we see right there. So the Chiefs can prove to 4-3. and three. What strikes me about Andy Reid is the fact that His record in his record in the AFC Championship game. So one and one right there. He lost to Tom Brady there. He can improve the four and two in the AFC Championship game uh, to make it to the Super Bowl on the 42nd day. So as as his time as a Chiefs coach to be 4-2 and two in the AFC Championship game, so six title games, winning four times, that fits Kansas City Chiefs, having Gamacho 64. Yeah, it is Patrick, that's Gamacho 33, but to me it's about the Super Bowl on the 42nd day. So regardless of where they play at, this is where it stands. Now, the Ravens should lose to the Jaguars, all that, and the Chiefs can win out. So I, I still think the Chiefs can uh, get home field and Patrick Mahomes get to the Super Bowl with a 13-3 record because of Las Vegas, Nevada, having Gamachi about under 33. So ultimately, I do like the Chiefs to get uh, a home, uh, the, uh, the bye, the home field advantage in the AFC. But as far as the Ravens goes... They're 2-2 two and two right now. Four title games, two victories, Super Bowl on the 42nd day. It can be five title games and two victories. It is uh, the KC Chiefs has come out to 52. And uh, the Ravens have fought a 2-3 and three because of Las Vegas 23 instead of going 3-2 and two against the Chiefs. That's kind of how it shows both sides. But obviously, Las Vegas has strong a narrative because that's where the Super Bowl is at. In a league of white supremacist owners, they were going to have the full blood black man defeat the golden child of the AFC, Patrick Mahomes with the blue eyes, all that, the pretty much three three quarters white daughter. It's, it's not happening. It's not happening. And uh, John Harbaugh's uh, AFC championship game record is going to obviously add a little bit of dimension. So his uh, AFC Championship game record, 0-1, losing to the Steelers, 0-2, losing to the Patriots, and 1-2. Uh, and two. He could try to become 2-2, uh, two and two, but, you know, I like 1-3. Just the, the, the Masons, like 33, is point thirty three. So overall, I like a loss. To be one and three in the AFC Chips game for Coach John Harbaugh.
And uh, John Harbaugh, he does have a history. Uh, I, I think, uh, yeah, he, he, he did defeat the Chiefs in the playoff game. It may have been the... Uh, as far as the Ravens and the Chiefs, the Chiefs lead the series 7-5. to five. They can prove the 8-5. and five. Just one of these teams will probably face the Dolphins in the prior round. The Miami Dolphins is Camacho 85. So, one of these teams... I This will probably mean the Chiefs beat the Dolphins and beat the Ravens, if I had to anticipate. To be 8-5? and five, Probably. If Ravens beat the Dolphins, the the Chiefs will the, the, the Chiefs will have to beat Miami. I like the eight and five there for the Chiefs to beat the Ravens because of uh the death of uh um Norma Hunt at eighty five years of age. So it may connect to her death and I've already connected June the fourth with uh, the loss in the Super Bowl. She, she died at Dallas, Texas. I've already made the connection with the Cowboys and the Chiefs right there. Uh, and obviously, uh, her death at 85, I can obviously see the uh, Ravens defeating, or the, 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 the Ravens losing to the Chiefs, you know, for the Chiefs improved to 8-5 uh, and five, uh, in the AFC championship game, so uh, eight and five against the Chiefs, eight and five against the eight and five, uh, you know, the Chiefs improved to eight and five in the series. So the Chiefs lead the Dolphins series 8-5. to five. They can prove the 9-5 because of Baltimore. I think I'm watching 9-5 to face off against Baltimore next. So ultimately, this is what I see uh, with that. Now, uh, Lamar Jackson, his playoff record has got to be, uh, uh, it has to kind of be significant in, in, a, in a big way. His first AFC championship game and obviously the defense, Baltimore is really great defensively. Two and three in the playoffs like Las Vegas. Six games, two wins, all of that. You know, uh, let's see. His playoff narrative is going to obviously be very, very interesting. If he's in the wild card round, then three and three before face off against Patrick. And uh, I can easily see three and four. For him, I think Maryland is Camacho 34. No, Maryland is Camacho 34. They did lose the soup, but they did beat the Niners in the Super Bowl, trying to win the Super Bowl again. So I can see the three to four for Lamar Jackson. And uh, there's something with the Cowboys and the Niners you need to see too, the all-time series. I'll go to Wikipedia for that one. Postseason results: Cowboys five to four. It's gonna be six to four. Kansas City Chiefs is sixty four. Winner can face off against Kansas City Chiefs. Obviously, Dak Prescott's record can be six and four when he wins the Super Bowl. Forty Nine ers is Gamacho sixty four. If the Cowboys face off against the Saints, then it's practically over. The suckers who think the Niners are an easy pick. I mean, they don't understand. Silver helmet at the Silver State. That's that's a gold helmet. Can't bet in California. These people are going to drive over to Vegas and start placing bets. It's bad for business. Here you slide Fox and be keen, and you can't go wrong with it at all because it's been a magical season for Dak being the one quarterback. I mean, Deron Bland picking up Richard Sherman like numbers. The Cowboys can win their 20th game against the Niners to make it to Nevada. This is what it comes down to. 20th. Win against the Niners to make it to Nevada to sweep up all the gold for the sports books to ultimately that's what the twenty is about as well.
And let's check home and away uh, for this series. So not just every game, but uh, Super Bowl at 41. This would be the 41st game in the series. If the Cowboys are hosting the game, the NFC title, they're going to be 10-9 against them because the last NFC winner at Los Angeles, Los Angeles, uh, is 109. And then away games at uh, uh, San Fran Frico, let's see. It will be 11th win for the Cowboys because Super Bowl, the 11th day all of that season began at the New York area. New York is the 11th state, so there we have it for the conference title games.